fragile. What's going on guys and welcome back to another unboxing of Nor's 8 Leg Critters. And, uh, this is going to be an unboxing for, I'm sure most of you already know, my friends and family at Paul Friction. Uh, they had a sale going on with 20% off uh, for Halloween. So, can't beat that price. And hopefully a lot of you guys ordered as well. I'm going to back this camera out a little bit. And here we go. Got my sheets here for what I paid for invoices more stickers which by the way thank you because I actually put these stickers up on my new uh, stand I got over there and there goes that and let's go ahead and open this box up I always make sure you check everything Alright, so it looks like it's all going to be in one, maybe, but I want to double check here, just to be for sure. Always check your box, even all the way to the bottom, just in case you never know that there might be some surprises down in there. Okay, so there's that. Alright, and let's go ahead and open this up. Okay guys, so the first one we're gonna do is the A Moderatum. Let's go ahead and get this one out of there. And it looks like he's pretty far down in there. Hope you guys can see that in us. See if I can focus on that. Right there. You can see his butt. I'm gonna carefully put this down in there. Let's see if I can guide him out. Here he comes. Just carefully poke him from the back because he's a little small guy. Come on. Come on, little guy. Come on. Come on. There you go. There, wow, he is a small guy. There you go. All right. There we go. And right there's the A. Modern. Let's see if I can zoom in a little bit on that because he is a very small guy. Right there. He is. All right, guys, we're going to move on to the next. Okay guys, so the next one we're going to do is the O, R to be Alice, and let's begin. And it looks like he was sitting right on top, okay, right there he is, let's see if we can back him on out of there. I'm actually going to zoom in on this one, so you guys can see exactly how I do this. Uh, hopefully these new lights and everything work out correctly, and let's hope he doesn't bolt. Got a nice fat butt there, alright, let's begin. Basically, just go right underneath them, just like that. This is the easiest way to get your range inside. Look at those colors. Wow, look how beautiful. That is a gorgeous spider. My goodness. Look at that. Come on. Get them a little bit more. Come on. A little more. Come on. I'm actually looking forward to growing with this one as well. These guys can be a little defensive. Oh, speaking of defensive, look at that. <laughs> As a swing. <laughs> so I'm actually looking forward to this one. <laughs> all right, bud, I know. Come on, you have to get down from there. All right, all right, all right. Go on, go on. Where are you at? And almost there you go, bud. Did you let go? Yeah, you let go. There you go. Boy, what a beautiful tarantula, my goodness. That is gorgeous. Let's see if I can zoom in a little bit more. As soon as I talk about the defensive method, there it went, huh? 
All right, guys, we're going to move on to the next one. <laughs> Okay guys, so the next thing we're gonna do is the feather leg baboon. If I can get that on here. Don't watch my fingers. There we go. And let's see if we can see him down in there. And he's pretty far down in there too. Down in there. Okay, what's, uh, er, there he is. Let's see if we can get him on there. There you little guy. You're gonna go, hopefully, that way. Oh, gonna go the other way. Of course he is. Let's see if we can get him down in there. And there we go. Yep, nope, oh, there he came back out. Go back in, bud. Go back in. Come on. There we go. Nope, oh, there we went again. All right, I'm gonna get that top on there, guys, and right there is the feather leg. Okay, guys, so the next one we're gonna do is the H Himalayana. And let's go ahead and get her out of there. See if we can see her down in there. Way down in there. I'm gonna try to pull this one out. See if we can get this one out. Nope, oh, there she is. There she goes. And there you go. All right, guys, we're gonna move on to the next. Okay, guys, so the next one we're gonna do is the S Cora Ricky. This is also going to be new into my hobby. I do not have one of these currently. And right there it is. Let's take a look and see where she's at. Oh, open up the wrong side. She's sitting right on top right there. It's kind of like it's got a bluish tint to the legs. It's pretty cool. All right, let's see if we can get her on out of there. Beautiful golden eyes. <laughs> and this one looks like he's not going to come with me, huh? There you go. All right, we're going to go ahead and move on to the next one, guys. After I chase him down. Hey guys, and the next one we're gonna do is the SP Karamaka. Let's see if I can get that to zoom in. Alrighty, and let's take a look and see where he's at. Go. Sitting right there, right on top. Man, it looks like he's gonna come out of his own. And you know what? I'm kinda glad that he is because I'm gonna get him something else. Carefully push him right there on the side. Come on, bud. Come on. All right. I'm gonna pause this video and I'm gonna grab something else. All right, let's go ahead and guide this little fella in. And there you go. That was easy. <laughs> All right, guys, on to the next. Okay, guys, and the next one on the list is going to be the S Obscura. And let's see where she is. Sitting right there, right into the top. Ready? Let's see if we can get her out of there. Hmm. Does she? All right, so you know what? I'm gonna try to pinch this one out. 
You win. Let's just see if I can do it. As I had something set up already, and uh, I'm gonna back out a little bit here, uh, that I had. Uh, I actually got this here at Dollar General, uh, and I burnt holes all the way around it, of course. And I always burn holes on top. Let me scroll out a little bit more. I always burn the holes up on top, and in case, because I can check the humidity levels, you know, by, by doing so. And if it feels like it's escaping too much, then you can just cover these with tape. That's kind of what I do. So, you know, um, what I'll do is I'll take tape on both sides to cover it so that way the transfer doesn't get her uh, foot stuck. But, yep. All right, let's go ahead and get this right back on there. Like I said, it was only a dollar. And I'll tell you what, you can't beat that price. All right, and let's see how much of a fuss she's going to give us. Here we go. This again. You can hear a little speed going. All right, honey, it's okay. It's okay. I promise. You're going to love it here. I'm going to slowly not stress her any more than what I have now. So I'm going to try to pump her down. Come on. Come on. All right, grab my paintbrush. She's definitely being stubborn with me. Uh, there it is. Yeah, it's not going to Okay. Oh, okay. There she is. There she is. All right. And as you can see, yeah, she teleports. You know, they're they're. Yeah, it's, it can be easy to lose. I'm gonna put this down so you can get a little bit closer. I didn't go on it. Nope, she went underneath the rug. Okay, well, you know what? We're not going to stress her anymore right there. We're going to head to cut the video and go on to the next one. The last thing we're going to do here is the M. Mesomelis, uh, the Costa Rican red leg. And I have one already, and I'm really working for a female because. I really, really enjoy these guys. I think they're absolutely beautiful tarantulas. I don't see too many of them at the hobby, but of course, if you can leave the description below if you have one, I'd absolutely like to see it. Uh, but these guys are absolutely beautiful. Let's go ahead and open this one up. It looks like he's sitting right there. Or I like to say she, hopefully this one's a she. All right, let's go ahead and get that on in there. Pull this one off and let's see. She looks like she's backwards. Let's see if we can get her out of there. Here we go. Come on. Come on. No? All right. Well, I'm not going to stress her anymore, just like the other one. So we're going to go ahead and yank her out of there. And hopefully it doesn't turn on me. Okay, here she comes. There we go. Wrapped here. All right, there she. Oh wow, yeah, she's actually uh, a lot bigger than the one that I had. Let me get my paintbrush here. So let me scoot her along. Oh wow, look at that. Yeah, much bigger than the one that I have. You can see kicked a little bit of hairs in the back. Like I say, I'm really trying for a female here. Let's go ahead and turn that around so you guys can see her. That is an absolutely beautiful tarantula. And I tell you, the older they get, the more beautiful they get with the legs and everything. Absolutely gorgeous. Looking forward with this one right here. Yep. Get off that paper ton. Oh, do you want to sit on there? Here, pull it from the detail. All right, zoom in a little bit on that one. Wow, beautiful, very beautiful. You know, it's funny, you know, our conversation is, what's your favorite tranche? I tell you all of them. <laughs> you know, there's so many beautiful species from around the world that, you know, just can't have too many of. But there she is. All right, so now what I'm gonna add to this video here, believe it or not, is the one that I have already, and it looks like it's gonna be a suspect male. I can't guarantee it. I'm gonna push you to the side. Put that on top. There we go. 
And then the one that I have is right here. Let's see if we can see it. Right there. And that's a freshly molted one right there. That one molted on me yesterday, I believe. And when I sex the skin, it really looks like it's gonna be a Mel, so. But uh, yeah, there you guys have it. Um, all right guys, so uh, hit that like or hit that thumbs down, which other one that you like, and hopefully you do like the video. Uh, again, thank you very much for viewing it, and we will definitely see you on. Okay guys, and like I said, I want to do a shout out for this for this uh, video to add to it. Uh, we're gonna get back to doing as many shout outs as we possibly can, and this shout out's gonna be for the Spider Woman. Check her out. Okay guys, so this uh, shout out's gonna be for uh, such an amazing person right here, and let me tell you, probably one of the biggest supporters out there uh, for Tarantula ho Hobbyists. Uh, this is the Spider Woman, and we're gonna go ahead and check through some of her videos here. And as you can see, uh, like I said, I mean, she's just a great supporter for other streamers, other uh, uploaders, hobbyists. Uh, she, she does a lot of things here with her uh, false widows. Uh, if you don't know who the Spider Woman is, definitely go check her out. She's such a sweetheart, uh, amazing person, and a big thumbs up to her um, for doing the uh, shout out for me as well. So guys, if you don't know who the Spider Woman is, I'm going to leave a link below and definitely go check her out. See you guys on the next video.